Sorry, Jogobo, but you know, personal. You just you came up, you know, you didn't ask permission, you just attacked. And it's like, you know what, dude? What's your problem? Just be a, be a cute little Jogobo who just chills. I like them in the 2D, like the Super Nintendo versions, because they're like, they're, they kind of look a little cartoony and stuff. Oh, got it. I got it. Oh, I will report back to camp. And he'll be like, What? How'd you do that? That's so crazy. He'll be like, You know what, guy? How dare you not trust me? Because I do. Yeah, yeah. Deafening. Bleffening. Okay, look, I got your so thing. You took care yeah. Of those little monsters. Oh, we took care of them good. You're yeah. Stronger than you look. Well, you know Thanks what? For dealing with that little problem. Say, can I ask you another favor? How much money do you have? Some of my people are in desperate need of wool. Why don't you of go wolf? and talk to the folk over there? They'll fill you in. Well, I will talk to the folk. And I shall wait. Oh, now I'm doing your chores for you. I heard you took care of our monster infestation problem. I'm impressed. Yeah, I killed like three monsters. I did a lot I worse than that. What, you want me to get you wool? I need help collecting wool from the sheep Are you wandering kidding me? Time slowly. Nice Noel and Sarah's prowess in fighting monsters and approaching them for help. I appreciate whatever you can do to help. Are You'll you come across kidding some sheep me? bigger than the others. They're the ones you want. Oh, they have the best okay. Help. But they have monsters around them. I don't know. Once you gather enough wool, can you... Yeah, yeah. I know, yes. Get the giant sheep. Wait. As a hunter, you should... Yeah, so the bigger sheep. Okay. So I gotta chase down the big sheep. So, where are the sh sheep? The flan are our main food source. Huh, like you disappearing, huh? Okay, so do I go out here on the plane? by the door. Where? No, choking me. I'm not talking to you. Go away. There he is. Ah, surprise! Yeah! Excuse me. Give me your wool. Yeah, I rip it out with my bare hands. No knife required. Is that it? Oh, there's another one. I'll chase you down, buddy. Oh, you're mine. First, I gotta attack these guys. It's a well-known fact when RPGs start doing side boring side quests. Then things start to become a problem. Just saying. Just saying that boring side quests ruin an RPG. And gathering wool is not the most exciting. And you know, I feel bad because I love Final Fantasy, you guys. And when I play the older ones, you guys are gonna hear the joy in my voice as I make voices for everyone. For, for uh, Locke and, uh, and all the other people that have weird names that now that I think about just saying them out loud may or may not be the right pronunciation. But don't worry, I say Tifa. Okay, is that the right way? I don't know. Who knows? All I know is I gotta get this giant sheep. 
I gotta rip the wool off of its hide. Get over here, punk. See, it's funny, because it's like, chase me! Oh, but guess what's gonna happen? Round of battles. Oh, but now you can't take my wool. Ha ha. That was a, that was a really punky thing to do. That sheep was totally mocking me. That was so rude. Okay. Chief Goblin Chieftain. Let's see what you have cooking in your bag of tricks. There's the Goblin Enhancer. Oh, okay. So the red is what attacks the bad guys are doing. So Sarah just got Goblin punched. Dude, you're so rude. Just stop it. Okay, okay Goblin Chieftain, you're next. I don't like the way you're looking at me, mister. I can't remember if you some kitty clock on you. I'll use some kitty clock on your face. Dude, he was totally like the last attack. That was great. That was awesome. Good job, dude. Kitty. Oh, look how far away he is now. That is so dumb. You're gonna get close to the sheep, and then you're gonna have a round of battle, and then the sheep's gonna run at you, but you can't grab him because you don't have a round of battle. Okay, it happened again. So dumb. Okay, look, we'll take these guys down, and then we'll go back, take down the weapon bucket. Yeah, come on, punk. Come on, Tuya. Auto chain. Goblin power together. Alright, who's next, huh? Oh, I'll just throw you in the air. Slam you with magic. Hey, Goblin Chieftain. What's cool is in the original Final Fantasy, like, the, before it was renamed and fixed and everything, if you would all attack the same guy, and he would die, then your guy would go and attack mid-air, like, in air, because the guy was already gone, but you chose to attack a guy that had already been defeated. So that totally wasted your move. Oh, this sheep is really starting to chap my hide. Oh, you're really starting to bug me. Oh my goodness. Oh, that was so annoying. A tuft of thick wool. What's worse than running around in random battle territory? How about literally running around in random battle territory to get a stupid sheep? Well, at least I can keep preemptive striking it. That helps. Helps ease the pain. The annoyance. That case says the sound is so annoying. See, the sad thing is, I think, oh! When's this game gonna open up and get really good? And then I think, oh, it won't. Because this is the game. Going through small little chunks of time. That's it. So, uh, yeah, it's not very epic for Final Fantasy. And I will admit, okay, I did enjoy Final Fantasy X-2. I really did. That was, the, that was kind of a fun game. Just kind of all poppy, you know, it didn't take itself seriously. And that's kind of what I liked, is it went back to the old school, like, uh, like, well, I don't know how to explain this. It went back, like, didn't take itself seriously. It said, look, we're just having fun with, with this, we're just chilling. The other thing is the fantasy setting. The fantasy setting, fantasy setting has really gone away. It's like, like, it's namesake, Final Fantasy. Go back to, like, fantasy setting. 
so that's why I kind of don't like the normal ones either. That's why I like 9 a lot. 9 is sweet. But I'll, I'll play that. Oh, using your big giant spiky hands on my little kitty, huh? Gotta do it. I'm a sucker for treasure chests. See, three whole potions. That's a lot. I know, now I have to do an extra battle. Because of that sheep. Okay, well, we'll get the sheep. Kind of, we're kind of threw him into a corner. That's good. Thank you. Yeah, we got it. Yeah, there you go. Alright, yeah, come on. I see how it is. Goblin C. Yeah. Now it's personal. Oh, once we stagger you, you're done for. You're done. There you are, ha! Huh? You're trapped. Yeah! <laughs> Take my hands and I rip out your wool. With my bare hands. Yeah, there it is. Three tufts of wool. Oh, don't mind if I do report back to camp. I'm already close to camp, too. So, if all goes according to plan, I can make it into camp. Yes. Something on your mind? What other uh, chores are you guys going to have me do? Huh? This. Oh, here, get my wool for me, because I'm too lazy to get it myself. Thank you so much. The quality of this wool yeah, is yeah. amazing. Here is a little something for your trouble. Oh, what are you gonna give me, the huh? Best hunters can run around these plains yeah. without a care in the world. Maybe, just maybe, you two can save us from the peril hanging over our heads. What peril? A storm? Woolly stone. I hear you're looking into what's causing the storm. Yeah. I don't know much, but I'll Kay. tell you what little I know. What do the you know? The storm only comes when it's really hot and sunny outside. What should we do then? Swear, wait for the weather to what change. What is she doing? There has to be something we can what? do. What? <laughs> weather controlling device nearby. <gasps> I'm not moving the stick. That was awesome. We're on a heat wave. What? The storm carries away monsters on hot, muggy days with lots of sun. Okay. 